Hi everybody, Jeff Hyland here with the Hyland Group, EXP Realty in Prescott, Arizona. I want to give you your November 2023 market update for the greater Prescott area. Here's the really good news. Here in the first week of November, we did see interest rates after having peaked just over 8%. We now have seen rates come down as low as 7.4%. Now, it rebounded just a little bit after that day here in early November, but we did see the Fed make the announcement that they are not raising rates, at least for right now. So a little bit of relief in the mortgage world, which is causing a little bit of an uptick in buyer activity. As we take a look at the month of October, um, what we did see, and remember, we were battling some pretty high rates there. When we look at October of 2023 compared to October of 2022, pending sales were down about 25% year over year. Now, if you compare October to September, they were down about 20% still. So um, that was right in the peak of the highest rate that we've seen, I think, since 2000. So no surprise there that it did slow some buyer activity. Talking about values, what we did see in October is we saw the values slip fairly substantially. If you remember from last month, we saw a little uptick and we kind of speculated on that as well where when the Fed made the announcement that rates were continuing to climb, it did spur a little buyer activity. Usually that causes a little bit of a run on the market and then correspondingly what we see is the market come back down. So we basically erased what we saw the gains were in September, as we see in October. Prescott came down 7.8%. Uh, Prescott Valley actually a small uptick of 1%. Chino Valley had a decrease of 13% and MLS wide was a decrease of 5.6%. So we'll continue to monitor that. Um, the good news of course is those interest rates which should spur some buyer activity. I took a look at the days on market. Again, our active inventory, that is to say when you look at every site built single family home on the market right now, still running right at 106 days on market. Now with this decrease in value that we just went through, if you look at the active inventory relative to the active sold price, MLS wide, not municipality specific, the active inventory is now priced 13% higher than closed comps. So obviously if you, the best way to determine the value of your home is to call and get an independent consultation, you know, set up a listing consultation with us. We'll come out and go through the nuances of your home specifically. So we don't price homes based on averages, but it is just kind of a good market trend indicator to kind of give us a broad brush idea of what's going on in the market. As far as inventory is concerned, basically staying stable. Now across the country, many agents that I sort of network with across the country are starting to report that they've got a six month supply of homes. And remember, a balanced market is about a six month supply. We're still at a 15 week supply, about three and a half months. So still slanted towards the seller's favor um, a little bit in that regard. We'll keep you posted. Usually by this time of the year, the inventory is starting to come down. And right now we're seeing it hold sort of constant, kind of mimicking what happened in the fourth quarter of last year. So that's your market update. If you have any more specific questions, if you wanna know what rates are for you, if you wanna know what your home is worth, reach out, call us, prescottareaproperty.com or call me direct, 928-237-4425. Happy to answer any further questions you might have. Thanks and we'll talk to you next month.